giving a voice to those who want to be heard. It's what a new Kansas commission is aiming at doing. 41 Action News reporter Jordan Betts spoke with members of the group and shares why studying racial equity and justice across the state is part of their mission. I think this commission is a great step forward towards the future of Kansas. Kansas Governor Laura Kelly is taking on the topic of race and justice following the death of George Floyd and the protests around the world. George Our first task will be to look at policing uh, and law enforcement, you know, throughout the state and you know, some of those practices within um, each individual city. Uh, but ultimately, we will focus on more uh, systemic issues, systemic racism, uh, and disrupting those systems of inequity. This week, she announced the new commission that will settle racial equity and justice across the state. Governor Kelly released in a statement saying, as governor, I'm committed to ensuring this latest tragedy does not fade into the next news cycle. Communities of color do not have the luxury of time for leaders to address these issues. There are some things that we need to address today, and there are some things that we need to put in place that will be in place for individuals that come long after us. Black Lives Matter! Dr. Anthony Lewis is one of 14 people on this commission. He believes they could help give a voice to those who want to be heard. This is a long-term uh, commitment uh, through 2022, and so I'm just really looking forward to uh, just getting to the work of putting systems in place, uh, dismantling systemic racism. For the next several months, the committee will hold listening sessions across the state to hear about the changes Kansas want to law enforcement. Then they will submit their recommendations to the governor. Commission members want you to know they're working to make a difference. I think our entire commission wants to hear from people who have had lived experiences and what we can learn from them as far as the reforms that we need. Jordan Betts, 41 Action News.